What's up, everybody? Sick Libra here. I am cracking out the first first impressions review of one of the tobaccos that uh, Andrew Cerigliano sent me. This is Samuel Gallus Best Brown. Now, uh, typically, what I do before I get into uh, before I get into a tobacco and do uh, first impressions is I do a little research to try and see what I'm getting ready to get into. I didn't do that with this one. The uh, the tin note on this one. It was almost what I would call uh, stuffy. Like, you walk into a room and it's like almost a little stale, but not quite there. It's just not a lot of air circulation. It just kind of had that, that smell to it. Like, it was almost a little bit stuffy. Not bad. Uh, especially when you consider uh, what kind of flavor it seemed to be going for. So, so, sorry about that. So, uh, the tin note was stuffy. I got it out and packed it. It was, uh, it was a little moist. I think it needs dry time. Uh, nothing wrong with that. It's pretty standard. Uh, I used the fold and stuff method. So, if there was a moisture problem, I it exacerbated it with that. But, you guys know that, uh, know about the moisture problems I've been having in this particular pipe the fact that it's not gurgling in the bottom of it says a lot so now the initial flavor of this uh, it confused me because I never had uh, a tobacco that tasted quite like this uh, the initial light was almost like sweetened butter without the salt you know a little on the buttery side which is an odd description for a tobacco I know but after you get past that, that initial I'd say buttery hit a um, few puffs into it and get the burn kind of evened out it's smooth it's mellow. It doesn't have so much of a flavor as much as a sensation with it, which I think is really interesting. And it's not like a sensation that you'd normally get with, uh, with your typical tobacco. Like, it doesn't have the tingle, the burn, the sting, anything like that. It's almost, uh... Just a fluffy sensation. Give me a sec. Okay. Now, I don't typically inhale, but if I want to get a good, uh, if I want to get a good feel for uh, for the tobacco, I'll inhale and exhale through my nose. There's definitely a little bit more flavor on that one. Uh, it kind of keeps the buttery trend. Almost kind of a, a bready type flavor with this one. Really smooth, really mellow. It doesn't have really any over the top uh, hits or notes really to speak of. This would be an excellent all day smoke. Um, outstanding all-day smoke, especially with as mild as it is. Once this bowl settled down, I don't really foresee it changing anymore through the rest of the bowl. So uh, I'm just uh, I'm gonna hop off of here and enjoy the rest of this and you all enjoy the rest of your day and thanks for visiting.